Hey, hi guys, Bidu here, back with another video, and today we're going to discuss <clears throat> my hybrid athlete program template and what is the update on my own hybrid athlete approach. So, first of all, what is a hybrid athlete template or a hybrid athlete program? What is a hybrid athlete? A hybrid athlete is someone who is proficient in multiple modalities of fitness. For instance, he would be he or she would be good with lifting heavier weights, power lifting. He or she would be good in running distances and running with speed. He or she might be good at swimming for longer distances, biking, uh, hiking, and all you know multiple modalities of sports. Some some probably a soccer sport or a basketball or something like that, along with the other sports. And how do we approach training? for this particular hybrid athlete depends on adding all these modalities in a program fashion in a planned fashion such that the recovery is not compromised and you are always progressing towards a end goal this is what a hybrid athlete program is uh, now how i have designed my own hybrid athlete template since uh, January earlier this year, uh, I decided to embark upon a hybrid athlete approach for the entire year and I am right now, uh, so this approach has been divided in 8 phases, uh, phase 1 of 8 weeks, phase 2 of 8 weeks, 3 of 8 weeks and so on. So each phase uh, comprises of your heavier indicator lifts, indicator means your bench squat and dead variations uh, it also includes distance runs initially i started with minimal 5k's and now gradually you know we're doing a longer duration run beyond 10 15 now we are eyeing a half marathon in the next month <clears throat> along with this alternate weeks are bodybuilding types you know if we i also want to build some muscle so i am adding high i am adding heavy duty approach you know last year uh, probably half of the last year i was into heavy duty i was exploring it and i loved it the gains that it uh, gave me the uh, the you know the kind of strength that i developed along with muscle it was amazing so week 1 would be more of a max effort or a power lifting template Week 2 is more of a bodybuilding heavy duty template. Now along with these, there is there are runs and there are bikes, you know, bike rides involved. That is what I wish to progress upon. So phases 1 and 2 were mostly uh, power lifting, bodybuilding, running and biking. Now phase 3 which is probably which started in March last month also included specific crossfit workouts helping me to get better at the upcoming crossfit event morph right which is two mile run 100 pull ups 200 push ups and 300 squats uh, now every year we do morph and this year i want to get better at the total time that i take to do morph and that is why i am also filling the gaps in the existing program, existing hybrid athlete program with pull-ups. So I am doing pull-ups almost daily. I started with 5 days a week, so now I'm continuing with 5 days a week. I started with 50 per day and now I am at around 70, 80 per day. Uh, at times I also challenge myself with 100 per day. And uh, it has really helped me to get better at the WOD workout of the day CrossFit style workouts. In fact, we have started with our Murph journey this particular weekend we are going with our first event which is quarter Murph and our finale is at uh, 26th of May which is the main Murph and uh, hopefully the Outlaw Army is going to blast it with the hybrid athlete program where do I see myself maybe uh, after this phase or after two phases three phases after one year uh, my whole and sole approach towards hybrid athlete training has been to get better at anything and everything in life. Now, fitness is always a means to an end. Fitness is never an end, right? So, when I say 
I train. I train for anything and everything outside of it. For example, if I have to hike somewhere, if I have to trek somewhere, for example, if I have to run a marathon, right? I should be ready. If I have to run a faster 10k at a race or something like that, I don't need to prepare myself specifically for that. You know, there are times where probably there is going to be a specific event like Murph, okay? And there are going to be a lot of outdoor events in the coming months. So that would be more specific and we'll find you in it. But the overall general fitness of strength, muscle, uh, power, endurance is going to always be there with me. And that is why I always wanted it. Because prior to that, it was more about one phase focusing on only on strength, one phase only on hypertrophy of muscle. Uh, some phase might be a little hybrid and then probably again turning it down to standard workouts. Uh, this way I'm I'm keeping myself ready for the stuff that is out there. You know, I don't want to lose out on uh, the amazing stuff and what what my body what what my body can really do. Yeah, and uh, I'm really trying to push the limits and uh, really trying to see what best I can do if I train well. So that is what where my approach is. If you guys want a hybrid athlete template, I am linking it down. It's a free hybrid athlete template. You can uh, mix and match your favorite exercises in there and you can you can really see how well it will work if you dial in your nutrition, if you dial in your recovery. Right? So uh, if you have any questions, please hit me up in the comment section and uh, I'll be happy to discuss. Until then, be the outcome.